Proverbs 27, 17 says, iron sharpens iron, so one person sharpens another. Now I know if you've been in our services recently, we have been in our big push to get people to participate in life groups. And we've talked about a number of reasons why it is good to be involved in a life group. But I think this verse in Proverbs gives us another reason, that it is in those spaces where we know one another, where we have the opportunity to spend time with one another, where we get to, to know one another on a deeper level, that we have the opportunity to sharpen one another, that we have the opportunity to point out where there might be a flaw in someone's thinking or to remind one another of what God's word says about a particular topic. We in our life groups have the opportunity to cause one another to be better than we are, to be used by the Holy Spirit to sharpen one another so that we are in the best shape possible to be used by God. And so, yes, I would say there's a lot of reasons to join a life group. But whether it is in your life group or in the friendships that you have outside of life groups, I would encourage us to be the kind of people who are willing to sharpen one another and to be sharpened by one another. Let's call one another to go deeper into God's word. Let's call one another to go deeper in our relationship with him. Let's call one another to be better in the way that we interact with those around us. Iron sharpens iron, one person sharpens another. Let's be those people today.